Hello. So I had one of our friends say that they wanted to learn how to tie shoes. And now is a fabulous time to learn how to tie shoes because tying shoes takes lots and lots of practice. And since you are home, it's a great time to practice. I have my fancy shoe tying shoe here. It has two different colored shoelaces so you can see what I am doing. The first thing you do when you are tying a shoe is you make an X and then you press one through the loop. There's my first part. Then there are many different ways to tie a shoe. I'm going to teach you the bunny ear way today. What you do is now that you've made your X and you tied it through the loop, you take one bunny ear, then with your other hand you take another bunny ear, then you make an X again, and then an X, and then one bunny ear goes through the loop. There's a little hole down there. You want that bunny ear to go through the hole so it's nice and safe. Then you pull nice and tight, and your shoe is tied. Ta-da! I'll do it one more time so you can see it again. So I make my X. I make my X. I pull it through the loop, nice and tight. I make one bunny ear another bunny ear. So the way I make my other bunny ear is I slide it out and then fold. I make an X with my bunny ears and then there's a little hole. Put it through the hole. Pull it nice and tight. Ta-da! So pretty! Another way that you can tie your shoe if you don't want to do the bunny ear way is a little bit of a trickier way. So again, you make your X. Make my X and I pull it through the big hole nice and tight. You make one more loop. And this one, you're not making a loop on. You're going to slide it around. And then now there's a hole there. You take that one and you put it through the hole and you pull nice and tight. Ta-da! I'll teach you that one one more time. You make your X, put it through the loop, pull nice and tight. Take one loop. Take your other one and you're going to slide it around. And now there's a hole there where I slid it around. We're going to pull it through that hole. Pull it nice and tight. So two different ways you can tie your shoes. One has one bunny ear. One has two bunny ears. It's whichever way is most comfortable for your hands and the way that your brain works. Either way, they both tie a shoe. So I hope that this helps you. And if you um, are practicing tying your shoes and you can get it, I would love to see a video or a picture of it. Um, so good luck and have fun.